everyone welcome back again on my channel it's your girl adela tutu is back again with another video today guys i want to show you how i make potato bechamel it's really nice it looks yummy and tasty delicious guys it's really nice i love it before we start, I don't forget to subscribe on my channel on the notification bell beside it that will notify you whenever I upload my new video. Give my video a thumbs up, share my video with your friend, and also comment in the comment section, guys. So let's go in the kitchen and see how I prepare my potato bechamel. Wait, once you follow the step, it's going to give you good result. Irish potato. This is my Irish potato is boiling. And I'm going to have add half spoon of salt on it. This is my chicken. I'm going to use full one. I'm going to cut it in pieces. No, cut it in pieces. What is it? So we are going to add salt. Salt and a quarter tablespoon. Right. Then we add. So now we're going to add curry powder also. Then I add black pepper. That's just it. And also, I also had mites. Might yeah. use the ingredients which is this way, and it's going to be fried now. So now, put your pan. Heat up your pan, add your oil, cooking oil, I'm going to add a little, it doesn't need too much to fry my chicken, this is my chicken. Now, I'm fried frying my chicken is done. This is my sweet of boil and pillage. Also, this is my carrot and a cucumber. This is the next second stem. Now, I've washed my carrot. I'm going to grate it. I'm going to grate my carrot. Time to grate my cucumber. The grating. I'll grate my carrot and the cucumber. Now it should be potato. Also, we are going to grate our potato. So you had your potato in your carrot to mix everything together. So we are 
going to mix it together with the carrot. So now I've mixed everything. So the third step is my cream. I'm going to use two. Chips, you add your chips, one spoon. After that, I'm going to add two spoon of flour, two spoon. Now I'm going to mix everything together. So now. We are going to add water in it. And mix it well. Now it's on fire. Put it in fire. Don't leave it. Continue to stir it. And you see that it's done. Don't leave it. This is how it's going to be formed. If you see that it's very cold, you, you can have more water. But make sure it's not watery. This is what the copper she made. I've had it in plates. Then I'm going to step it aside. You had. When you cook it, you see that your potato doesn't have salt, you add no salt. You had enough, then you mix it with it together. You can mix it now. You can mix it with your hand, you can mix it with the spoon. Make sure you have salt on your potato, which is enough. I've tasted it, I see that the salt is not enough. The first thing to add in your plate is your chicken. You add it first. With your potato, you see, take a little, you wrap it, wrap it through your palm, put it there. See now, make sure it's the same size, don't let it too much. Now I'm done. Now here I'm going to take my shemel and you put it up around the potato. Make sure you feel it run. Just fold it in it. Run. So now you add your chips and finish. Just little. So it's going over. Huh? The trolley is going over. So this is it. You allow it to brown a little bit, not too much. It's ready for eating. So now it's ready. It's time to cut it. I cut it and I put it in plate because there is shapes there. That was why it was like that. 
and put it in play to enjoy our bechamel. Thanks for. Thank you for your support, guys. See you in my next video. Bye bye.